everybody. I want to do something a little different in this video. I've had a number of people comment on this awesome Lobo shirt, and I've had a number of requests for a t-shirt tour. So I thought I would go through the t-shirts that are clean and are in my uh, cupboard right now, but uh, starting with the things that were in the back of my cupboard that I don't wear very frequently, such as my Doble Uruguaysha uh, shirt from the, uh, the for Peñarol, which was the team that uh, I favored while I was living in Uruguay from 2001 to 2003. So, uh, soy mancha, as they say. Uh, another one that um, many of you have seen recently. This is a Grip6 belt company. A neighbor of mine is one of the founders of Grip6. A wonderful belt company. They've got a very cool technology that they use for their belts, and they also make phenomenal socks, and then they've also started a company called Bird that makes uh, pickleball rackets. So if you're into pickleball, check out Bird. Uh, then we got one I've only worn a couple of times, but a lot of folks recognize it as uh, the t-shirt that Seuss wears in the wonderful uh, cartoon Gravity Falls. And then I've got my old uh, Salt Lake Bees uh, shirt got to represent. They're moving their, their stadium from uh, downtown Salt Lake to, to actually uh, just near me in um, uh, Daybreak in South Jordan. Then this one's a little small. I don't wear it very frequently, but I do have a, a Deadpool shirt. I'll probably have to bust it out at some point in the future. I don't know that I'll ever wear this one again because it got visibly stained. But just some of my own merch, my uh, Data Over Dogma t-shirt. Uh, one I've I've haven't worn in a while. An old Sublime T-shirt. Sublime was the first CD I ever bought uh, after Casino Night. As a senior in high school, I won a Disc Man and went out the next day and bought three CDs. I got Sublime self-titled album. I got No Doubt Tragic Kingdom and I got uh, Metallica's Black album. Then we've got. A Marvel shirt just featuring a bunch of characters. Got a couple of those actually. This one's a little more colorful. Uh, and then, oh, I have this wonderful shirt from a friend of mine named Jason who runs um, Great Basin Seed Company uh, out of Utah. He was one of the folks who joined me uh, on my tour of Israel Palestine uh, earlier in the year. And we've got a great Miles Morales' Spider-Man shirt. This is one of my uh, favorite Spider-Men. I, I particularly enjoyed uh, Sarah Pacelli's uh, penciling on uh, a run of Miles Morales. Uh, this is also too small. I don't wear it very frequently. But the last time I was in Oxford, I figured, hey, I need another T-shirt, another Oxford T-shirt to have around because the old one I just... Uh, war into the dust. And now, oh, blast from the past. I was a big fan of these uh, these cartoons when I was a kid on Nickelodeon, although that was right around the time I was kind of growing out of that kind of thing. This one, I, I like this t-shirt. It's a little hard to tell what's going on. But that's Daredevil. Um, and yeah, in most of my videos, you don't see enough of it to actually tell what's going on. Got a great The Batman t-shirt after I uh, went and saw the uh, the Robert Pattinson Batman. Let's see, good, there we go. When it comes to X-Men, it's got to be either Jim Lee or Joe Matarira. Those are the two goats for uh, penciling X-Men. This is a really old Flash t-shirt. I don't know how many years I've had that, but it is old. Got to represent the Chili Peppers. Uh, one I, I wear quite a bit. Really like that one. Uh, this is, oh, this shirt's been around for a long, long time. This is a new... Um, I just got that recently, but I know that that uh, design has been around for a long time. Another Grip 6 shirt. That's probably one of the most comfortable shirts I own. 
Got this. Oh, this is a good one. Really like that Batman uh, shirt. And this is uh, this is the best shirt I could find uh, for Spawn, even though I'm not a fan of the penciler. I would have preferred to find a uh, a Todd McFarlane or a Greg Capullo uh, version of that, but it still works. And we got good old Bizarro Superman. Fun X-Men uh, cartoon t-shirt. Uh, we got just a Marvel t-shirt and then the last one in the pile. Another Daredevil t-shirt. So a uh, lot more Marvel than DC just because right now they <laughs> they make better t-shirts than, uh, than DC does. But I'm always on the lookout for uh, some good uh, DC stuff and this is not all of them some of them uh, aren't clean right now so uh, they weren't down here in my office but uh, hope you enjoy